Hi, I'm Neil Robertson, 2010 World Snooker Champion. I'm just going to show you a few different shots, um, how they might come up in match conditions, and they're going to get a little bit harder as we go along. So in this situation here, uh, we've got two reds and the black on a spot. Um, the black is covered into this pocket here from the red, and we have a slight angle on the red, and uh, the easiest way to play this for a position on the black would be to run it through off two cushions, but we can't do that in this situation. So uh, I'm going to show you how to play it um, with a lot of backspin to draw the white ball back on and off the cushion for the black in the same pocket. So hit quite low on the white, touch the left hand side. And that's pretty much perfect. So in this situation here, uh, we're snookered full ball behind the red that's over the hole. Um, our opponent's missed the red and uh, has, has, has covered it. So um, there's no other reds available, so the only option here is to maybe come off a cushion, hit the red, or to play the swerve shot. And um, the, the best option here is probably to play the swerve because you've got better control over the cue ball. So you need to um, elevate the cue quite high like this and play a lot of right hand side uh, to swerve the white around the black. Uh, so we're going to have a, a go at this here. So you need to elevate the cue very high, a lot of right hand side. Just like that. Still got a pretty tough shot on the black but at least we've got out of trouble and uh, can continue on. So this situation here, um, got a red over the hole with the black quite close to the same pocket. Gaining position on another ball apart from the black is pretty tricky here because we'll have to pot the red very thin, find a, a small gap to come back down this end of the table for the blue or one of the bulk colours. So probably a shot to play is like a banana shot where we play it with a lot of top spin and a little bit of left hand side um, to arc the cue ball around the black and then we can start um, with trying to make a really big break. So um, I'll get down and play this shot here. Um, so play it with a lot of top spin, a little bit of left hand side and hopefully arc the white around the black. And like that, it's pretty much perfectly played, nice angle on the black and uh, hopefully we can start um, by making a, a really big break from that position. So hopefully with these shots that I've shown you, it's given you a good insight into how uh, professionals play certain shots and uh, more importantly, hopefully it can uh, help you win an extra few frames off your mates.